Hey, it's your girl Kita, and welcome to my channel, More Kita. So, as I mentioned before, whenever it's cold, all I really want to do is put on something warm and cozy. However, when I do go out and about to certain events, I do like to get dressed up and cute. So, in today's video, I want to show you some outfits that I actually do wear in the wintertime. When I go to certain things like maybe shopping or lunch or brunch, things of that nature, because I'm typically always in the house, I even work from home. So, when I get a chance to go out and do something, I do like to go ahead and get dressed up. So if you're interested in seeing this and seeing the outfits that I actually wear in the winter, then go ahead and keep on watching. So speaking of warm and cozy, sweaters are great for an everyday winter outfit. This particular one is a neutral color so I can style it with multiple different looks. It does feature a V-neck neckline and three buttons in the front. I really like these type of sweaters because they typically hit me at the waist but they're long enough where I can still tuck it in the front. This style gives me a nice silhouette while keeping me warm. And typically I will wear my sweaters with jeans. So today I went ahead and paired them with a pair of wide leg jeans. These do have light distressing, so it's still okay to wear for the winter. And you can definitely pair these with flats if you're tall enough so they don't drag or a cute pair of booties. Okay, next is this really pretty ripped sweater dress for a winter date night. This dress is pretty heavy and pretty thick. Now I am wearing it backwards because the split is supposed to go in the back. I sized down based off of the reviews that I was reading, but I wish I got my regular size because when the split is in the back, it stretches out really bad and it looks like it's screaming for dear life, y'all. Since this does have a split, I think pairing it with some thigh high boots will be a really cute look and both of them together will definitely keep you warm from head to toe. Now this next look is definitely something I will wear on like a shopping day. I love these type of wraps because they're super easy to throw over any simple outfit and it makes it look like something special. I wear these type of wraps all the time and last year I did do a video where I actually DIY two of them. So I'll be sure to go ahead and link those above so you can go ahead and check them out when you're finished watching this video. And then with this look, I will pair it with some comfortable jeans and some comfortable booties. That way I can walk around, do everything I need to do and take care of and still be cute. This last and final look is something I would wear if I was going out to dinner and I didn't really want to dress all the way up or wear a dress, but I still wanted to be cute and comfortable. This is a matching turtleneck and jogger set and typically when it comes to joggers and sweats, I wear a size large, but the reviews were stating that you need to size all the way down. So I did go ahead and take a chance and I ordered a size small, but I'm so happy I did because I'm loving the fit of it. Now the only thing I wish I could change is the crotch area because it is a bit low and then the pants do come up a bit high on me and I'm loving the fact that you can style this with so many different shoes. I mean you can go casual with some sneakers, put some boots on, some booties, and since the snow has melted in my area, y'all already know I'm about to break out my heels and wear them before the snow comes back. I hope you guys enjoyed those outfits that I actually do wear in the winter and I hope it did give you some suggestions as well. Be sure to go ahead and check the description box down below. I'll try to leave a link to all the items that I can definitely find. And if you want to see more fashion as well as more lifestyle content and of course more Kita, go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as that notification bell and I will catch you guys in the next one.